An emotional and confusing day for Mohammed Fayez Ghazi's family and friends. What was meant to be a simple court appearance for Ghazi's alleged killers turned out to be a scramble for them to get access to the courtroom. They were denied the right to see the men accused of a hate crime. The investigators still have to conduct an ID parade. Most of the people, including the media, were brought out of the court because um, we will be v uh, taking visual. It's taken us all by surprise, I think. Uh, we were, first of all, denied access to a free court. Uh, I've never seen this happen before. But anyway, uh, we want to give due process. The two suspects allegedly taunted and attacked the 27-year-old businessman outside this Mahanisburg food outlet. They then called him a terrorist because of his long beard. Ghazi's friend, who was with them at the time, says he wants the alleged killers to pay. I just want the justice for my brother, for my friend. He wants everything to me. And that's all I ask because he doesn't done anything just because of his appearance. Ghazi's death has sparked outrage amongst Muslim community members. They say they've been ridiculed about their religion far too many times. This happens to me whenever I'm in public. It's mostly in the malls. And I've been told on the last occasion in front of my two-year-old grandson, you should be in a Bin Laden movie. And I was so humiliated. And I was really, really in pain. The two suspects are due back in the dock next week, Tuesday, for a formal bail application. They remain in custody. Lorenzo Temba, Kruger's Dog.